The Oneida Treaty was signed on February 3rd, 1838. And uh, what that defines are the uh, boundary limits that we currently have from that are eight and a half miles wide and 12 miles long and encompasses 65,430 acres. And they liked the Duck Creek area because it was most like their ancestral lands where they had the white pine, they had plenty of game, uh, bear, deer. Uh, Duck Creek is named by the Oneidas, the place of many ducks. About 654 Oneidas were here and the treaty was there to establish boundaries where we would create a permanent homeland and that land would be secured for us forever. Well, the treaty needs to be recognized forever. A treaty is long-standing. It's a legal, do legal binding document between the United States of America and uh, the Oneida Indian Nation. That this is our home. We are going to continue to regulate our people in our land and make laws that affect our people in our land within these boundaries.